we're going to turn now to the world of art. Echoing the report we had last week on the talented young artist Keith Church. Keith Church was a student at Goldsmiths in 1975, and now he's finally given his first exhibition 35 years after his murder. Our reporter Melissa Fernando takes us closer into the artist's work. Curated by his cousin, Professor Kurt Barling, a former TV journalist, the exhibition entitled Urge to Pain has finally come to public light after being kept within the family's care. Keith was murdered aged 27. The murderer was never found. It's an unsolved crime. There are very few unsolved murders in Britain. This is one of them. And the family have never really been able to get full closure because of that. And they've kept the paintings almost as a way of keeping hold of Keith. When Keith Church started painting his emotions and creativity on canvas, he certainly was clueless that his paintings will get to be exhibited 35 years after he was stabbed to death in Broxburn, a case that is still unsolved in Britain. There's that instinct to keep it private, but also that instinct to share it, overlaid with the fear of opening up the wound of his murder because it's unresolved. And so it's been very difficult all the way through, even the day before the exhibition began. From the first drop of paint on the canvas to the art exhibition, it involves a lot of mixed emotions, skills, drives and behaviours. Each piece with a story of its own. To help people think about the glory of his work, this was a young man who was extremely industrious. That much work in six years is extraordinary. It shows he was a compulsive painter. The urge to paint title comes from his own writing because he had that compulsion to paint. Goldsmiths, together with the artist's family, have produced an art exhibition of some of his artworks from the 2,000 pieces from his collection. And I go to the open evening and um, Keith's art was on show and that is me at the kitchen sink. Well, he did care about the world, he cared about people. He, he saw the very bad in the world. And um, he saw the good. As written by Keith, art is a result of an urge, controlled and applied by the will of the artist. The exhibition is open to the public and will go on till the 9th of February. Melissa Fernando Louis Chem, Yellow Plus.